Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem 7 ROM Hack Dream of 5. I'm your I'm your host, Pondon, just adjusting my mic levels a little bit. I'm your host, Pondon. And last time we died in Chapter 14A, where we have to fight some freaking dragons, man. We're fighting, look at these guys. They're strong. They're beefy Draco zombies. I mean, they got no luck, though. Um, so I did things a little bit differently this last playthrough. I... Pretty much sent everyone up the middle until this, except for this group over here, which has like migrated its way from the bottom up. And I just decided to hang out at the bottom and just deal with the reinforcements. Katrina still died, but it's fine. Um, Colbain pretty much soloed this spot until Ilanice flew over with Melissa. And now they're all kind of in rough shape right now. But there's just so many reinforcements coming, and I just need to be really careful because this guy moves and he is scary as heck. All right. So let's see here. I want to like, basically my strat has become let's clear out as much as possible before we have to deal with these dragons because I can't, it's hard enough to fight these things. So I may as well just like eliminate all other distractions as quickly as possible because they're annoying as heck to deal with, man. I do not want to deal with them. And I kept, I'm keeping the animations off for a little bit because I need, I just want to like get through this, honestly. Let's see, potion, let's see, heal you up. Alright. I feel like I just need to get like all of my units in one place to like completely bum rush the dragons. But this is just going to take so much time because um, I just have a lot of dudes that are coming at me from all sides. This map is just so big. This is me, this might be the worst defender of big maps. Marius almost died, but he lives, thankfully. I decided, yeah, I decided to bring Marius instead of Annalise because he can take a few hits a little bit better. Not significantly well, and his hit rates are still Garbo. Like, he's just not very good at this point. But he has mount utility. He tanks a little bit better than Annalise would have. So I was like, you know what? We just gotta go for this. Can help with like rescue strats and stuff. I don't know, man. I'm doing what I can to try and make this work. What do you got, Gareth? Can you just iron longbow this dude? Yes. Thank you. Get out. Get out. I do not want to deal with this. I'm just so mad at the reinforcements. There are so many of them. All right, let's see. We'll heal up Gabe the babe. Yeah, guys, like I'm all for tough enemies. But when most of my army is, like, in really rough shape against them, it's tough. It is tough. Okay, I gotta, like, clear this area out real quick. I mean, at least they're not flying. So I can choke up on this, like, bridge here. But jeez, dude, look how many are coming. I'm just gonna, like, have to wait these dudes out, basically. I really hope that's the end of them. The thief's gonna go for the chest, but it's the last chapter. I'm not gonna lose sleep over it. If anything, the thief will just help me know what it is for next time I play this. Okay. No more reinforcements. No more reinforcements. Alright, I think we're good. Let's see. How are we gonna do this? I feel like I need to heal up Melissa this turn. But also, yeah, let's do this. Colbain with the Iron Axe has been pro. He's still nowhere near Hurlbat, which is a drag. It's a freaking drag. Let's see. Get him. Thank you. I really, I really wish I had the Dancer right about now. That would probably have made things a lot easier for myself, and maybe I wouldn't complain. Uh, so, when it comes to units that are hard to find, and maybe, like, maybe I'm overstating this. Because I'm sure it'll be obvious once I actually look at the map again. But I was told, like, he was in Chapter 9. Like, I think units like Dancers and Refreshing units that have a lot of utility. Let's see, actually, I think I might do this. 
Yeah, units that have a lot of utility like that, like a dancer, or like... Uh, actually, no, Saren's fine here. She can she can tank. Um, yeah, units that have a lot of utility, like like those types of classes, man, like... Those are not things that you want to, like, put in a secret character. Like, I get, like, Kaga did it in Tearing Saga. But, even still, man, like, I don't really agree with that design choice. It's interesting. He did it in, um, what's it called? Thracia as well. And I thought that promotion was kind of interesting. But, like, man, putting important units in, like, really tricky spots. Like, I feel like... Hmm. It's a tough balance, man, because, like, on one hand, I feel like you should reward the player for finding something cool, but on the other hand, you should also, like, make the stuff that comes up in a secret event not necessarily be the most game-breaking thing, because, like, it totally changes up how the player approaches it, and chances are the player who didn't find it is the one who's going to need that stuff more. So, I am conflicted. On this, I'm curious what others think about it when it comes to, like, how do you incentivize the player the right way with, like, secret characters and things that are hard to find. Like, I'm of the mind that the stuff that's secret should not be essential to the game. It should be helpful, but it should still be, like, pretty comfortably beatable without that. Maybe I'm... Maybe I'm just, like, more annoyed about other parts of this game where having a dancer would be really nice. But, like, look at this, man. I'm just, like... Just let them come at me. Gareth will just do his thing. Let's see. Gareth got a level up. Let's see. More speed? Skill and defense. Okay, let's go Gareth. Okay, where's that thief? Alright. Okay, let's see. We gotta get some heals going over here, boys. Let's see. Elenice and Melissa, I really need to get out of this spot because they're both just like getting beat up from this poison here. Let's see, Colbane with the Iron Axe, yes. Using using my peg to set up kills for my overkill hero, that's exactly what I'm doing here. Let's see. Oh, okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna rescue. I'm gonna go here. And then... What are these guys packing? Poison swords? Jeez. Hero sword, that's scary. Okay. All these sword dudes, man. Let's see. Gabe. Yeah, finish this guy off. I want to get Saren over there, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Okay, Gareth will finish this guy off, thankfully. Heal him up. Yeah, so I guess with rewards, man, I want just to finish my thought on it. Still haven't decided. I mean, for me, like, as I've thought about, like, the game that I'm making, I've made it so that, like, the stuff that like, I want to have secret stuff because I think it's really fun. But I also recognize that. I don't, especially because there's no guide, right? Like, in a ROM hack, like, there's no guide. It's not like vanilla where it's like, oh, like, I want to play Thracia, like, I'll play with a guide and I'll be able to get all the shit anyway. And I can just appreciate, like, what was designed, what was done. With a ROM hack, it's like, there's very rarely, like, all any of this information out there. So, you really are going in, like, totally, totally blind. Let's see, how do you do against these guys? So, I feel like ROM hack should have difficulty reflective, or rather... Rewards reflective of, like, their situation. Oh, actually, she does pretty good in this spot. Um, yeah, let's do that, actually. Let's do some Marius over here. Yeah, I... F so, like, for me, I've put stuff... Like, the secret characters are, like... Like, if you miss them, you won't necessarily miss them. But if you want to use them, you can. You know, like, they can certainly fill a role in your army as Marius gets a pretty solid level up. Um, they'll fill a role in the army, but they won't necessarily, like, be your army. Which I think is an important distinction. Something like a dancer, do I want... I mean, yes, it's very powerful. But, especially if I'm designing... I guess, this is my thought. If you're going to have secret stuff, you shouldn't design your chapters around assuming the player got the secret stuff. You should design the stuff, the chapters, assuming they don't. Because that also makes the secret character that much more... Oh, holy shit. Oh, fuck. That wasn't good. Oh, that was that was 
poopy. Uh, uh, freaking dragon. Alright, this is looking real bad, okay. We gotta pin the dragon. Let's see. Okay, we can pin the dragon. Okay, this actually doesn't look too terrible. Let's see. We'll get Cobain. Yes, Cobain do that. Saren over here with the Iron Ant Lance. We'll use this one. And then we'll heal up Gareth. That was that was bad. This, this dragon's range is insane. It's absolutely insane. So now I gotta go over here with this dragon. Alright. Okay, now over on this part of the planet. Let's see. These guys are all just looking super rough. And there's just so many dudes coming in hot. Um, let's peel back a little bit. I mean, none of these guys have two range besides the mages. I really don't want to deal with the mages just yet. I think I might peel back a little bit. Oh, wait a second. Oh, she can get hit. But actually, can you die? 33. Yes, you can die. That was ill-advised. No one can take River? This is so just such a drag. Okay. Um, I mean, that's my own fault for not checking ranges. Okay, so... Marius, how are you doing here? Oof. Oof. Alright, let's do... Actually, Arcus can do something here. Let me move Amelia first. Because I think I want Amelia up there. First, I need to heal. Heal Renair. Okay, that doesn't help very much. Let's see. <laughs> okay, let's just dump you first. Alright, then Angel Ross. Can he do the May Thunder? Alright, that, that works. That's a nice level up for you, Enjo. Okay, I just have to like be okay with Marius dying here, honestly. Because he's going to take some hits, regardless. Or I could just put Arcus there with the Ram Reboost. How does Arcus do against these dudes? Two. He's, doing, he's not really taking too much from these guys. He's got eight res. How much does this guy do? 18, that's 10, that's another 10, that's 20. He'll probably live. I think I want to get rid of this Poison Lance dude with the Ram Reboost. Yeah, this guy, he doubles, so let's do that. The rest of these, I just don't want to deal with Poison anymore, to be perfectly honest. Let's see. Iron Sword, there we go. Okay, then... Can you use the May Thunder? I actually don't even think you can. Is this Enjoras' Tome? Hmm, I wonder. No, you can't. Okay, that is Enjoras' Tome. Okay. Alright, you're pinned. I think this is about as good as we're gonna get it, boys. Let's see. Okay, that's fine. No one else can attack her except maybe the Mage. Oh, no, the Mage can't get there. Because Arcus is in the way, thank god. But man, Hero Sword reinforcements, dude. This game really does not fuck around at all. Let's see what happens now. Arcus taking care of these mages is so clutch. Oh no! Whoo! That would have been real bad. Uh oh. I don't have time for you, Archer. There's a dragon. <laughs> okay. 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 Breathe. We're almost there. Marcus is totally trapped. By a swarm of reinforcements that are aggressive and mean. Alright, let's see here. Alright. 
Villainese is going to take drop whoever I had here. River Phoenix. Okay, then let's do this. Just get out. Get the fuck out. Okay. Do you have a potion on you, Gabe? Yes, you do. Okay, let's see. You do some solid damage. Maybe a little bit of crit. But I want to do this because she needs the heal because she won't survive without it. Gabe can take a hit. Okay. Dragon is pinned, but th th these guys are looking rough. Okay, thank you, Asher. Melissa. Let's just mend it. I don't even want to risk it. I'm sure he, she has enough, but... Oh boy, like... Let's see. Can we do May Thunder over here? Thank you. Okay. Three range, Lightning Tome. Super clutch. Clear this guy out. Alright. Now... Arcus... Yeah, just get rid of this guy. He's the scariest one. Alright, the rest should be doable. Let's see. What do these guys have? Hero Sword, Hero Sword, Poison Sword, Poison Sword. Holy heck. Like, we're not out of the woods yet. Nowhere near. But... Renair doesn't one-round them with the Iron Sword, which is good in this case. But heck, man. What does Chester do? Chester... He's got better hip. He's got better dodge, but I don't trust him. Alright, let's see here what happens. Yeah, like... I really want to, like, explore the map, but I really can't. Like, look how this, this is just, like, incredible. No, the Ram Reboos! You've been so good to me. I knew that would happen someday. I really loved you, Ram Reboos. Please don't kill. Thank you. How am I going to kill mages in one shot now without the Ram Reboos? No, Arcus! He's so vulnerable! Let's see. Okay. So this is the strat, guys. You just gotta pin the dragon and suffocate it, basically. I'm just, like, smothering this dragon. Alright. Once these reinforcements are... This should be the turn, guys. This should be the turn. So we get rid of the reinforcements, and then we can go properly dragon hunting. I hope this is, this is like, been more fun to watch than it's been to play, because, who boy, this has not been that much fun to play. Okay, let's see. Gabe's just gonna move out. Heal him up. And this is just gonna be enemy phase of the game until the dragon dies. Basically, that's how I have to do this. Um, let's see. Renair can do that. Let's see. Amelia can do this. Let's see. Is there anyone else coming up or coming out? No, there's an archer up there. There's a dragon over there. <laughs> Just a casual dragon. All right. Let's see. Then Marius, what are you saying against this guy? Oh, Marius can do it. Marius! He did it. All right. Now we're clear. Now we heal. We did it, guys. We absolutely did it. Now I'll get Renair over there to help support her bros. But heck, man, that was a freaking journey. Whew. Melissa's been getting some great level ups, honestly. But Asher is still better. Better as a healer, at least. But all right, let's see what happens now on this next exciting turn. I'm gonna try and just like get her over. Okay, let's see. I love the dragon on the throne, I just think it's so funny. Ooh, that was nice. That's what I'm talking about. We just gotta rely on crits. Alright, you're gonna go steal stuff, but that's fine. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let's see. Colbane, what are you saying with this extra support here? Well, Colbane can do it. Colbane! We did it, boys. We slayed the dragon. Nice. Very nice. Alright, so now... 
What does this guy have? Fortify and a potion. I don't really have enough stuff to get all of it, so let's just wrap around here. We travel as one. Now I have to move all of my units up to this other dragon. That's what I mean, guys. Big maps. They they look great, but holy heck are they, are they long to play. Like, look what turn we're on. We're on turn 22, and I've only done one-third of the objective. This is absolutely wild. Okay. My healers are getting a thorough workout, though. Okay, now we'll move everyone out. But I don't want anyone to stretch too far in case there's like random triggering spawns or some garbage like that. Let's see, here you go. Move everyone up. Leave them there. Let's see. What is what is he stealing? Lorenzier, no. It wouldn't be very helpful right now anyway, so that's fine. Alright. Yeah, I don't really know how the game expects you to do all these side objectives <laughs> and deal with the dragons. Like, holy shit, this is not easy. And I mean, it's workable if you, you know, let's see, can you pick up Gareth? Yes, you can. It's workable if you, um, let's see, what's the word I'm looking for? Yeah, it's workable if you, uh, just like totally like commit to turtle, commit to the turtle. We're gonna go for the middle dragon. We want to take. We're taking out Throne Dragon next. I'm also curious. What is this guy's range? Oof! Just outside of it. All right. Let's see. I'm gonna like get everyone just a little bit closer so that I can do the wraparound. That was the strat last time that I really liked the wraparound. If he now this will be something like this will be the game really throwing you a sucker punch. It's like you put a dragon on a throne and he moves. Like I mean, I guess the dragon wouldn't care about the throne. Theoretically. But even still, man, like... I don't know, why would you even put it there, then? Let's see. Okay, Gareth, let's move you over here. Colbain up here. From there. Here. Move you over. We'll get Saren over here. Alright, let's see what happens. Okay, he's gonna keep stealing stuff in the... The, the cleric's unchained. Let's go. All right, now let's see if this guy moves. Okay. Let's see, Gareth with the Iron Longbow. Where else can this guy go? Okay, anywhere here is unsafe. So, I might move. Yeah, I think this is really... I'm gonna pick up Saren, because I can just drop her somewhere near the dragon. Alright, let's see what happens. Goes for the thief. 9,000 gold. Rest in peace. That would've been nice, actually. Okay, throne dragon does not move. Let's move in, then. Let's just inch our way a little bit closer and see what happens here. Will he go Dragon Pike? Oh, that would probably be really helpful right about now. Um, Alright, so this guy stays put, which is neat, I guess. Okay, let's see. I'll let Gareth deal with these guys. I'm just going to like bring all these dudes up now. Dude, if I get borked because these things move, start moving in. I'm gonna be so annoyed. Let's see, can you steal this? Aha! Chester. Gotta salvage this map somehow, right? Let's go. Okay, so let's see here. Yeah, I'm sorry this isn't probably that much fun to watch, but I wanted to beat this on screen. I feel like it's the least I can do. Alright. Move in all my dudes. I mean, at the very least, no one gets one hit, which is nice. At least without like not without like getting crit or whatever. But heck, man, like, heck. Okay. Come on. Thank you, Gareth. 
Dude, Gareth's the MVP of the run. No doubt. Hands down, it's Gareth. Let's see. Chester's gonna fight this dude. Actually, can Chester 1v1 this thief for the Dragon Pike? Mm, but this guy, the dragon's in the way, basically. That's so annoying. Alright, never mind. Chester's not gonna sacrifice himself for the Dragon Pike. Let's see. Renair up here? What is Renair saying? Renair will live. There's no one else over on this side that will come bork me, right? Yeah, so we got Renair here with the bloody edge. We'll get Gareth. We'll heal up Gareth first. Is relying on my support supported units, guys. Let's do it. Let's go. This is why we build supports. It's to fight the dragon. Oh, the, dude, putting the dragon on the throne. Look at those hit rates. Oh my god, this is going to be garbage. Okay, Colbin can actually double the dragon, which is really funny. Double dragon. Double dragon. Yeah, let's, um... I like how the these are the same weapon. That's funny. Okay. Alright, let's see. We'll just move these guys up a little bit. In case anyone needs a heal. In case I need to, like... Bring in the scrubs to like do the finishing finishing blow. Not that they're like all scrubs, but you get what I mean. Let's see what happens. Renair. With a crit. Clutch. Alright, maybe we can turn animations on. I mean fighting a dragon is pretty cool, I will say. But like this man, let's see, Colbain. I kinda wanna give Renair's cap, the we're to Colbain. Let's see it. Alright. I like this music too. Are these custom Draco zombies? Let's see. There we go. What do we got, Colbain? What do we got? <laughs> Dude, I'm giving Colbain so many levels. He's absolutely insane. Look at that. He's probably going to cap speed soon. That's nuts. Alright. We're very close to pulling this dragon now. Which we're going to do. With the great bow. It's time to use the great bow, guys. Let's come to that point in the run. Let's show off some Melissa. My cursor will show off too. Alright. We got Melissa, healing Gareth, our good friend. Okay, let's move everyone else in. These dragons are not. Ha I've just gotten lucky with crits, but man, like you gotta be so careful when you fight these things. And I can appreciate how different this fight feels, but I just think I just wish the map layout was a little bit better for it. Crit him? No. Oh, look at this. Mr. Thief, you're done. Uh oh, Chester's near death. Ha! I don't think Chester has room to steal anything. Oh, he can steal stuff, but this guy is. Oh, he could totally steal stuff from this dude. Alright, we're doing that. Um, let's see. So now we'll get Colbain over here. Let's see. 22. Actually, we can just kill him. Let's just do that. Let's go for it. Gareth! Nice! Just throw Gareth and Colbain at everyone. Dot PNG. Alright, let's see. No. Colbain. 1212, yeah, that's that's a, that's a wrap, I think. Yes, that's a wrap! We did it! With the Iron Axe, let's go! Colbain! He's so, he's so buff, look at this. Oh my god, I think he capped speed. Watch out, guys. I have this unit, he's ready. All is lost, all is lost. The dragons are dead. I, I surrender. Mercy. Lay down your arms and you'll be spared. Be saying is free at last. Ooh, look at this music. Listen to this music. My lord, the castle is secure. Everyone within has surrendered his arms or is in a cell. The servants are coming out of hiding to clean out all the blood. Ha! Excellent. 
Today has been a glorious day. Never, you'll never take the crown, you hear me? Usurper! Someone grab that fool, Guillaume. Oh, he's apprehended. The calves, they did something. Ugh! What are you doing? You kill my dragons. My beautiful, beautiful dragons, and now... Down, traitor. We're to make an example of you, as you did to so many others. Where is the king? What have you done to him? The king, why? Why, he is gone. Long gone, aha. Arg. Where is he? King's blood. What? The ritual required the blood of the king. He's dead, long dead. His bones rot just like my beautiful dragons, dot, dot, dot. My lord? Marius, find the chopping block. A clean execution's too good for an animal, but we shall have to make do. Fuely? I'll make it clean. If nothing else, he was still highborn. As you will. Wait, what are you doing? No, get off me, peasant. On your knees. No way. Oh, this is cool. We got some art. Look at this man. They're about to execute him. Holy heck. Soldiers would be sane. For many years, this man has been the cancer eating away at the heart of our country. Yet this shall stand no more. He's really going to... Game. For your crimes of murder, injustice, and your treatment of your own citizens, you are to be executed. Treason. This is treason. No game. Your perverted acts have corrupted the very crown you wore. Your very nation itself is still reeling from your actions. That... That is treason. Fuel, make an end of it. No, you can't do this to me. Oh, that was cool. The applause. It is done. And now a new age begins for me soon. Someone. Dude, Fuel just went in on that. Explain everything to Fleur Karovian. She has the best claim to the throne and a small army to hold it. Doubtless, Coolhand's rebels will defend her as well. She will make a worthy queen. It is a pity Uther not survived the conflict. Yes, my lord. Rejoice, men. Our troubles are over. So he just gives it to Floor. Wow. Look at those bricks up top. That's a little funky. So I guess this is the end. We sit in Usain, pass five few renegades, but I might never see my homeland again. Renair. Well, anger Renair. What? Who's there? It is, uh... Anazorthurion. Sounds like one of those, like, ingredients you see on the label. I died 700 years ago, slain by Paul the Crimson for my pride. And now you have saved me from the tyrant. So arrogant he would have the dragons fight at his beck and call. It is well that he is dead. Now I may rest again. I, I am glad you can rest. What do you want of me? It was said that we dragons were a proud, cruel kind. Perhaps that is right. Maybe it was for the best that we were driven out. Yet we are not without honor. You have left my soul in peace. And now, before I am once again one with the void, I would grant you guidance. Guidance? What would a dragon know about my hardship? This goes far beyond what you could dream of. Heh, it seems perhaps that the pride of the dragons did not die out with us. You are strong, Renair, or Duresh, stronger than you believe yourself to be. Duresh? I'm no noble daughter, and I've never been near Castle Duresh as long as I've lived. So you believe. How amusing. Nevertheless, you must head west. Head there now. With all your strength, bring the silver-haired mage and the Visharan knight with you as well. There are allies waiting for you in Akuma, and only by banding together can you reclaim your honor. If only you join what you, the units you would have gotten if you went on the B route, then all will be right. But I'll act on it nonetheless. Thank you, Anaxi. I appreciate the thought, although it appears your tongue cannot catch up. And now at last I can rest again. Da -da -da. The presence guy as quickly as it came. I have to get everyone. Oh, we got the innkeeper music. Let's see. That's why I'm going west again. I'll need your help to do it. And you sure this wasn't merely some hallucination? Give me some credit then, Joras. I knew that something was there. Well, there's no question of my loyalty. I'm with you till the end, Commander. As am I. I'm sure the rest of the lads are with me too. <coughs> you can count on me, my lady. You'll be the first into the fight. Ha 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 ha. I've saved you this far, haven't I? I know where my loyalties lie. Uh, we get to see everyone. As long as you've still got a use for me, I'll be there for you. My life is yours. I'd be dead anyway if you hadn't saved me, and I won't flinch at the thought of danger. Uh, I suppose so. <laughs> Can't complain about the pain we've getting so far. I'll stay true to your banner. I'm not as sure as any, and I'll keep my word. I may not be a fighter, but I can still heal your wounded. I'm with you. If I wanted to run, I'd have deserted when we were captured. I'm not leaving now. Wherever the fates may guide us, I will follow. The eternal soldier of fortune. A tramp of return. Oh, this is the bard that we were supposed to get. <laughs> they really thought you were going to get him. A tramp of return into the homeland. Salvation for the downtrodden. Ah, how magnificent. I've surged up to now. I see no reason to stop here. Well, if you're all going to follow, then I guess there's nowhere else I can go. Just don't come kind to me when we get our asses kicked out of the country again. I have no more commitments, and my duties here are done. I will follow. And Joros? When I was in need, you helped me. Now it is my turn to help you, and forge a bond between our two nations that will last forever. Flora can handle this by herself. She's a strong player of politics, and she still has the remnants of the Brunth armies to keep the peace. I will fight with you. We are together, we shall make the world a better place. 
Wherever my master leads, I will follow. Quite. I'll lend my sword to him once again. I'll, I'll go too. I can fight and I can protect you all. Or all of you. Thank you. Thank you all. Hey, wait. Oh, what? Who is this guy? Yeah, who are you? I am Stolpin, noble of Musain. I, I have a cool hat. I wish to join you on your adventures. And why would a kid like you, especially with your rag, want to join us? I've always been holed up and protected, unable to see the world. I wish you the beauties of the world, and after hearing of your plight, I want to help you. Especially after your actions, here in Musain, ridding us of this vile usurper. Alright, get your belongings in order. We leave tomorrow morning. Yes, sir. Now that was, that's chapter 14, guys. I think that's the end of the patch. So, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I'm going to share my closing thoughts in another video. Um, I'm going to just make a separate save over um, 9A there. But, who oh boy, that was a chapter. I mean, I don't think there's really much I can say that I haven't already said. The map is really big. The dragons are really scary with all the reinforcements. Like, you got to either tone down the reinforcements so that it's better paced and that it can actually move. Like, if there were fewer reinforcements, I feel as though I could have at least tried to go with, like, what the map had set up for me with the split routes and all of that. But given the density of the enemies and how beefy they were, I needed to just, like, turtle up, get everyone in one place, take them on one at a time, and just, like, kind of, like, just like that previous chapter where I'm just, like, going through them one by one by one because that's the best way to handle them um, because they are really scary and they will bork you. So I'm not super crazy about the map. I think it's cool. Um, I think the story is cool. I thought the execution scene was like pretty well well executed, no pun intended. Um, it's like a pretty like metal approach to this kind of stuff that you don't really see in vanilla or other realm hacks. So I can I can appreciate that. Um, I think the stuff with Renair talking to the dragon is kind of contrived, honestly. It's just like, oh, I defeated this thing and now it's talking to me and telling me to go home. Like, I mean, I think they could have come up with a more compelling reason to go back. Uh, to join up with the other group than having a dragon basically tell her so. But I don't know what else was in store for the writing and if this is just, like, the first of many, like, things. I mean, it's clear Renair's, like, gonna find out she's a noble. Um, she's gonna go through, like, her alm thing, um, probably. Hopefully without having to kill her dad. But, spoilers, sorry. Um, but yeah. I think, um, fighting dragons? Cool. What I've done, I would have done this map a little bit differently. I would have made it smaller. I would have had fewer reinforcements, and that probably would have made the map just a lot better. I think kill having to fight three dragons is pretty neat. Um, really neat concept. It was just hard to do with all that extra stuff going on, so had to play it really slow. Didn't get any of the rewards. I also didn't have a lockpick, but I didn't steal one in the last chapter because I didn't bring Chester, so that's my own fault. But that's how it goes, guys. That's how it goes. But anyway. That was chapter 14, Confrontation. Let's see what else is left. Oh, we go to chapter 19, Dragon's Gate. Let's go. Renair and her cadre had finally reached out, able to... Let's see. Let's see. I kind of want to just see what's here. What? <laughs> this is just vanilla. Well, let's see something. Okay. All right. Is that... This is supposed to be Darren. And here's Maxime. That's pretty funny. Okay. So it's clear this isn't done. And who we got over here? We got a dragon. Uh, Alright, this is funny. Okay, so this is basically dragons. Get, waiting for the gold to show up. Um, but anyway, guys. This has been chapter 14A. That's the end of the patch. I'm going to make another video talking through my feelings in a bit. And um, actually, let me just rewind real quick. We'll save here, just to be safe. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Take care.